guys once again welcome back to my another video so in this video i will show you how to make mini hydrophonic farm at home so let's get started first of all guys you need a plastic cups you can get it anywhere in any shop it is in low price second thing you need a styrofoam box or any buckets trays etc that's up to you and make sure it has any lids so you can keep the plants in second second you need uh, some plants that's up to you i'm using chili spinach and okra or lady's finger and first step you need to make holes in the lid of the styrofoam box what i am doing is making marking at top of the lid to make a perfect hole second step is make sure that the plastic cups are correctly fitted inside the holes third step is making holes to the plastic cups for the root formation i am using a hot metal rod for making holes Now, third step is selection of plants and medium. I am using vermi compost as medium and chilli, spinach and okra plants. Spinach and chilli are the best hydrophonic plants. Now, selection of plants choose tall and healthier plants and make sure it has more than two leaves pluck it gently because small baby plants are very sensitive while plucking up fourth step is transferring seedlings into the cups just make sure that the roots should only immerse in water remaining part of plant should remain on top this part very carefully because the roots could damage and the plant could die now just hold the stem and cover the hole with your hand and fill one by fourth part with vermi vermi compost you can use any tiny stones sand rock wool clay pebbles as your convenience I don't want to make the video too long so I did the same for other plants too and just transferred into the box
I have already did one just for testing and here's the result. In this I have just kept spinach and chilli. So guys, plants also need oxygen for the process of respiration, more efficient. It is, it is also called aerobic respiration. So for oxygen, I am using air pump. This is completely optional, but to make your hydrophonic more efficient, use the air pump with air stone. You generally get this in aquarium shops at Rs. 150. So that's it for today video guys, thanks for watching, make sure you like, share and subscribe for more videos.